Hi there, this video is a quick example of how to save and organize your work correctly on a Windows PC machine. Not a Mac, there's a separate video for how to do this on a Mac. So here it is on a PC. But before I show you this, I'm gonna simply go to my desktop. See here I have a folder that's called Schoolwork. All right, Schoolwork, have a folder, make a folder on your desktop that's called Schoolwork. Go ahead and open it. This is what it looks like inside. I've made a separate folder for each of my subjects. How organized is this? Now I'm gonna go ahead and show you in English, for example, I've actually made subfolders inside English to organize them in the units that you're doing. So for example, the first one might be a persuasive unit um, and you're gonna go ahead and create all of these folders before we get started saving the work. So, okay, now to the act of saving the work. So say this is my work, this document that I've just done right here. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead from Microsoft Word going to go file in the top left hand side then save as or save a copy for example I've already saved this one so save as will be you I'm going to go ahead and click browse and it's going to bring up the file explorer you're going to go ahead and find your desktop you're going to find that that beautiful folder schoolwork you created and look at this organization you're going to find your English folder because this is an English task for example for example, this one is in unit two. There's nothing in there yet. Imagine this one is called task one essay. Whoops, essay. Task one essay, I'd like it to match the CRLT or the task, the learning task that's up on Compass that your teacher has put up. That way it's easy for your teacher to see. You're gonna go ahead and click save. And it will save it in that folder. So. If we go back now quickly back to schoolwork and we're going to jump into English and we saved it in unit two, remember? And there it is, organized, beautiful, easy to find for you later on. Fantastic. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Bye.